Hello guys, it's me Hawk16 and and today I'm going to show you how to make the old version of IMBU run in on macOS Big Sour uh, update. Just before we start guys, I have to tell you some things. Um, first, uh, if you have any doubts about the program that I'm using, please uh, contact me on my Discord. Uh, I'm going to reply every message uh, since I'm not um, sharing with you any um, drive files this time. Um, and don't forget to stay tuned to the channel uh, by clicking on the subscribe button, uh, hit the bell for notifications and hit the like button of the video so I can uh, continue to upload content on this channel. So yeah, we are going to continue with the video. Uh, first of all, you, we are going to iview.com. Uh, either of those of these two um, pages are going to work fine. Uh, if you are on the iView next, you can click on your um, avatar image, then scroll down to uh, get get the desktop app. right uh, here and it's going to derive you to this uh, page same with the uh, IMU web index uh, if you go to downloads it's going to derive you to uh, this this page go to release notes and we are going back to the same um, process that we've been on the last video but this time I'm going to show you which of uh, the programs that we are using and how it works. So once we have uh, our release notes page, we are going to scroll down to the bottom. And here we have the version 539.4. Uh, always, this is independently on when you are going to uh, watch this video, remember always check this date, and this is going to be the date that of releasing. So, um, of course, uh, IMBU will be releasing new updates uh, every month, and but for you to check the version that we are using, uh, it starts with the B. Uh, 539 uh, could be uh, the next one could be for example 540.0 this is going to download the file it's a ex point exe file so once there um, as I, I already did I already uh, downloaded the file so if I go to finder you will see this uh, the installer IMBU 539.4 and you can see there's no white page this is because I had the crossover already installed it well I went to codeweavers.com and I scroll it down and got the trial version and then I buy the, the whole thing so once you once you get the trial version of you buy the one, uh, it's around thirty bucks. Uh, it depends on 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 the region. It's around forty, but you will have the whole future. And this is the one that works on macOS Big Sur. So it's the only way to make it work because Code Weaver crossover version 19 that is the one from the old video I uploaded a couple of months ago it's not working anymore on Big Sour. See, once you installed a uh, crossover and double click on this file on the IMU installer so this is going to open this window from a uh, crossover software installer we're going to browse unlisted applications and hit continue uh, 
uh, and once there you hit the install button and it's going to start the process remember uh, as this is um, this is a exe file a Windows Windows installer it's going to process a Windows uh, installation um, but it's not going to allow us to uh, continue the installation so we have to go to system preferences in system preferences we are going to uh, security and privacy and once uh, security and privacy windows uh, opens we are going to unlock the lockpick the lockpad put the name and the password well the password actually and this is going to unlock the lockpad for us to proceed with the installation process of IMU it's going to take a few minutes but um, it's going to process the whole thing uh, give it a time it all it will all depends on the MacBook you are using or uh, the iMac that yeah that you are using so now you can see that the IMBU setup it started uh, also it created the bottle um, so this means this only means that we are ready to install the application so the installation process it's already done it's going to start loading the uh, well the windows lo loader there there might be a window pop out here that says that that the developer cannot be identified so what you will do there you will press ok right uh, it's going to look gray or something something like that so what once you do ok you're going to go back to the security and privacy and it's going to appear uh, a message that says allowed anyway uh, once you click that it's going to uh, start the um, loading process so okay now that we have our IMU logging we are not going to log in yet we are going to close this uh, this is this is my taking a little bit more than the last time because well this is a way much uh, completed uh, with way much complete software so we click on done click on IMU run drag it to the desktop once there we are fine to go and we are going to run IMU and there you have it, uh, IMBU running on macOS Big Sour. Um, just a few side notes. Um, this is uh, the same the same box from the last version of Crossover is still there. Uh, there's no being there's just been uh, a few improvements on the uh, way it looks. For example, well, it looks a little bit. Uh, uh, a little bit faster uh, my Mac it's not as good as as, <laughs> uh, as the new ones but it's going to run perfectly fine uh, but uh, well on the chat rooms you won't be able to see the friend lists uh, the only way is by inviting by messages or something uh, also you are not going to be able to use the creator mode here um, since you cannot upload um, textures in in this version so with that being said that's it guys thank you very much for watching and i hope i see you soon um, keep tuned to the channel for more information about uh, how to run uh, ibu on mac os and 
I will see you next time.